Today I thought for my first vlog that I would teach you the way that I normally chop an onion. No, I didn't come up with it on my own. I did watch plenty of Food Network and finally found somebody that chopped it the way I thought I could actually chop it. Sunny Anderson with Cooking For Real is one of my favorite shows and as you see I use a lot of her recipes on the onyx plate. Her method I found is the one where I'm least likely to lose any fingers. So let me show you how she does it and how now I do it. First I like to prepare my onion. I remove the entire outer skin. I'm just weird like that. I'm afraid there's germs on it from the grocery store. Remove the entire outer skin. I cut the bottom half off so that it sits nice and flat on my cutting board. I also have cut the end off in preparation while pulling the outer skin off. You leave this little end here. Isn't it cute? Like a little tail. Leave the end on. This will help you when you're chopping the onion this way. First off, I take my knife, my lovely knife, which I love. And by the way, husband, I wouldn't mind some Wusthof knives for Christmas. Anyway, wishful thinking. I take and cut my onion going through, trying gently not to cut myself twice. Once towards the bottom, once towards the top. Just using it, getting it through there. Then I'm going to take on the top and going almost to the very end here, but still leaving the crown of this intact, I'm going to poke my knife straight through and chop down. A few little pieces may come out, but that's okay. Just the way the onion is circling. Yes, I just said the onion is circling. We're going to continually cut through here. And I'll show you what I'm doing here in a second. Right here, I made little cuts here. See how they're being held together by the top? So get our little excess out of the way so as not to make this more difficult. Now all we have to do, take our knives and chop down and we have chopped onion. See how easy that is? And obviously make sure your hands are clean before digging through the onions. After that, we take our top here and we just cut it down just like we would normally. If you have any questions, you are welcome to post them below this video. But after that, only about what, a minute? We have nicely chopped onions. Hope you enjoyed my first vlog. I did enjoy sharing it with you. Now, go caramelize these bad boys in some nice, yummy, extra virgin olive oil. Have a great day.